I will be reviewing a book on title How Animals Live. The author of this book is Steve Parker. This book is published by Miles Kelly Publishing Company. There are 50 pages in this book. The advantage of this book is it is really interesting to read because there are amazing facts and cross references are given. There are also have check it out section in each pages so that we can find out more by surfing the internet. Photos and artwork in this book really amazing because they look real and clear. Each topic is clearly illustrated. Some images are labeled to providing further information. The disadvantage of this book is this book is quite heavy and the core of this book is very hard. Sometimes it's getting heavier when I hold it for a long time. But it's okay. Another disadvantage of this book is this book is not provided by the school library. We have to buy a set of book and it's quite expensive too. I like to read this book because it explains well how the animals live on earth. This book explains how the animals live in their habitats. How do they communicate each other? How do they warn to the danger? And how do they take care of their young and many more? This book gives me many benefits where I gain a lot of knowledge by reading this book. For example, Look here, the animal sense, the sense of some animals are thousand better than ours, while other senses that we do not have, such as being able to detect the natural magnetic force of the earth. One more, the best part of this book is about Camouflage. Camouflage is a wonderful thing. Camouflage is a type of coloration or pattern that helps an animal to blend in its surroundings. Many animals are born with camouflage. Many animals have camouflage so that they can live in the forest. For an example, a barren caterpillar lays on a leaf so that the predator comes for the food. As an example, a crocodile remains on the surface of water when the prey moves closer to the crocodile. Tigers also hide in tall grasses when the prey moves closer to the tiger. Birds, like an owl, sit on the tree branches in blue black wood to the prey. When the prey moves closer to the owl, the owl will catch and kill the prey. This book also teaches me to love animals and take care of the animals. Human activities such as cutting down rainforest trees or polluting water with chemicals can be dangerous to the animal habitats. This book gives me a very good lesson. Let me share with you. This planet has given us and other animals to live. It's the duty of each one of us to respect and preserve the planet from calamities which are caused by unnatural errors such as pollution and global warming. We can help to reduce global warming by planting more trees which can be a good environment for the animals. So let's take care of the animals by keeping the planet clean together. Thank you.